An update on Miami-Dade. Hank Tester is live at election headquarters there. Hank. Well, canvassing board meeting here at the uh, headquarters, going ballot by ballot, uh, checking out just exactly whether they would accept it or not. Let's take a look. There they are, the last remaining ballots to be counted in Miami-Dade County. The Elections Department canvassing board meeting late in the afternoon to examine ballots that were cast, mailed in, or delivered to election headquarters. This is a routine function for the board, but critical because it appears that due to three statewide races being so close and all likely to go to recount, each vote accepted will have an impact. Miami-Dade has 971 ballots to check over before counting or rejecting them. The process could take most of the evening. So far this evening, the board rejected 293 provisional ballots due to registration to vote too late by some voters and earlier decided to accept 198 ballots that appeared to staffers to be valid. This process will continue through the evening with observers and lawyers for candidates for governor, U.S. Senator, and Agriculture Commissioner keeping a sharp eye. Well, we're told that the uh, canvassing board has just wound up. Remember, they went through 971 ballots. We will take a look and get inside and uh, figure out just exactly how many they did accept. And that's critical for these races that are so close. Uh, every vote can certainly make a difference. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News. Back to you.